the number of three digit numbers which end in seven and are divisible by 11. So brilliant, three digit numbers that end in seven. So dash dash seven. What do we know about divisibility by 11? It's a beautiful test of divisibility. Add odd position digits, add even position digits, subtract one from the other. The difference is either 0 or a multiple of 11. We are through. Okay. So the number of three digit numbers which end in 7 and are divisible by 11. Very simple question. Why? Because I can put a pattern to it. What is the pattern? I am thinking about 1-7, 2-7, 3-7, and then I will fill in the remaining number. 1-7, okay. 7. 1 plus 7 is 8, put some middle number here, the difference should either go to 0 or it should be a multiple of 187, 1, 1 plus 7 is 8, subtract 8, go to 0. This will work. 2 plus 7 is 9, 297. This will work. 3 plus 7 is 10. Initially, I thought when I was doing this, everything will work. But funnily enough, 3 plus 7 is 10. I cannot subtract 10 and take it to 0. I cannot subtract something and generate 11. 3 dash 7, nothing works. 307, 317, 327, seven, seven, nothing will work. 3 plus 7 is 10. I cannot generate a total of 10 from here. That doesn't work. 4 plus 7 is 11. So I put a 0 here. The difference is 11. This will work. 5 dash 7 is 12. I cannot subtract 12. But I put a 1 here. I can subtract 11. This will work. 6 dash 7. 6 plus 7 is 13. Put 2 here. 7 plus 7, 14. I put 3 here. 8 plus 7, 15. I put a 4 here. 9 dash 7. 9 plus 7 is 16. I put a 5 here. Or there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 numbers. And so 8 numbers that are possible totally. The other way of thinking, you find one number. After that, you keep on adding 11. You will find the next multiple of 11. But our unit digit should be the same. Should not so if when will the unit digit be exempt? Your one digit unit digit is seven. You keep adding something, you want the unit digit to remain as seven. You should add a multiple of 10. 17 plus 10 is 27, plus 20 is 37, plus 30 is 47. Or you add a multiple of 10, you will end in 7. You add a multiple of 11, that will happen to be a multiple of 11. From 11, multiple of 11, you add any multiple of 11, you will get to another multiple of 11. Or from here to here, you add 110, multiple of 10 and 11. From here to here, you add 110. From here to here, you add 110. Plus 110. Plus 110. And you can count how many are there, which is why from 297, you add 110, you go directly to 407. There's nothing in the 300s that works for this. Gosh.